TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and currently we've had a bit of a mixed bag out there. That mix coming from the semis transport New York Stock Exchange, where they're trading a little bit lower. The Dow's up 22 points. The S&P is flat. NASDAQ is up 12 points. Russell's up 5. Gold's up $2.40. Silver's down 24 pennies. Lights we crude off a buck 60. Natural gas up 15 cents. That's a 7% move. And the 30 year Treasury up 25 ticks. She's printing out at 120. 28. Let's go take a look at all that means out there by take a look at our nine panel market update chart. We begin by take a look at the ES mini. The thing you should notice here is that there is no support until we get down to the 3844 level. We do need to take a look at where that weekly oscillator and change line is priced at. I don't have that on this chart here, but we can do that most certainly during the Trader's Edge show. If we take a look at the VIX here, it does have an A to B equals CD pattern to the upside. And if you did get a bearish reversal candle today, right now at the moment, it looks like a shooting star, uh, you would have a sell the D point pattern. Now, I have not done the studies of A to B equals CD patterns on the spot volatility index out there to know whether they act as our other A to B equals CD patterns. But for the moment, I'm going to go ahead with yes. So we'd be watching for some type of bearish reversal candle. If we take a look at the NQ, it has traded back to support. So unlike the ES Mini that doesn't have support, the NQ does. And the NQ is where we want to keep our eyes. Why? Because it's got that support out there. And it's a bullish structured profile. So you can see the one-to-one -one A to B equals CD to the downside. It's completed the one-to-one -one price projection level. That was at the 12086 area. It's also down at the top of its daily profile, a uh, weekly profile that is at 12070. That is held. It's inside, or it's tested, I should say, the bullish structure area of its daily profile. It's between 11,975 and 12,083. Okay, so support is held in the NQ. We'll take a look at the NQ's intraday charts, each of which show bottoming signals as we speak right now. If we take a look at that U.S. dollar index, it is attempting to close above 104.16. If it does that, which is a bearish structured daily profile, we should see a further move higher. For example, 105.56 would be the one-to-one -one A to B equals CD price projection. In the case of Goldilocks out here, Boy, it got rid of its new profile. Well, I guess it uh, just simply hasn't formed out there. So the only support level for gold is 1827 for silver. It's the bottom of its daily profile, 2144. Light sweet crude, bottom of its profile, and weekly and daily profiles. That's between 7264 and 7364. That's your support area there. And if you get a bullish reversal candle in the natural gas today, you'll have a roads with the indicator bottom pattern. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show. But if you're off to start your Wednesday, please have a wonderful one. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care.